course mechatronic system so already we have started about the introductory part of the arduino i rohit gohan our assistant professor department of mechanical engineering kit is college of uh, kit is college of engineering kolapur so continuing with the previous lecture so in previous video we are discussing about some introductory part of the arduino continuing with this in today's session we are going to discuss about the id of the arduino uno id is nothing but the integrated development environment of the arduino uno so how to program on a arduino already we have seen some introductory part but how to program it so once the circuit has been created on a breadboard first you have to create a hardware circuit on a breadboard then we will need to upload the program so whatever the program we have uh, written in a arduino is called as a sketch so we have required to write a sketch for a arduino the sketch is a set of instructions that tells the board what the function needs to be performed means what is required to perform that will tells by this all these sketch and arduino you know board can only hold and perform one sketch at a time means one arduino can perform one program at a time so if you want to program two three arduinos and you have to connect required to connect the different arduinos the software used to create the arduino sketch is called as the id that is a integrated development environment which stand for integrated development environment the software is a free it is a open source so the software required to download this uh, arduino programming is a freely available just you can go to the net and just you can write that as uh, arduino.cc it will give you the different software just you can download it next so what is this arduino id how it looks okay so first you take a one minute and look at the picture that occurs the right side of you this is the exact id the id home screen which you look whenever you have to draw the sketch once you download this software or installed on your pc or laptop okay when you have to open it it will show this screen okay now we are going to discuss about each and everything of this id in details now the first thing if you have seen here the number first that is a menu bar which gives you access to the tools needed for creating and saving the arduino sketches it includes file edit sketch tool and the help the next button which having the uh, sign of a right okay so that is a verify button okay when you comply your code and check for the errors in a spelling or a syntax so if you have to draw or write the program here and when you are going to check it just you have to click here for this verify button the number 3 is a upload button it is a arrow mark look at this it is a arrow mark towards the right side it sends the code to the board that is connected such as arduino you know first you have to upload the code next you have to verify it and when it is correct then you have to click it for a upload the button means whatever you have code written there it has to be uploaded on that arduino uno so number 4 is a new sketch means once a program has to be uploaded and you require to modify it or you require to run the another program so the new sketch has to be open so just you have to click it it will show the new window and there is a blank window you have to write there code so it will give the your new program there and one thing remember that one arduino can only run only a one code at a time next five is a sketch name when the sketch is saved you have to rename it and whatever you have to give the name that will display there that is a sketch 
Number six is a open existing sketch. Means whatever you have to, if you have a different program and you have to save there, just you have to click here on a, that existing sketch and you have to find it and you just you have to upload upload there. That is what you are uh, open the existing sketch. Seven number pin or a seven number where you have, if you have to click there, it will save your the current sketch what you have written there. Number eight pin is a serial monitor. Means when the board is connected, it will be display the serial information of your Arduino. So if the board is connected or not, it will show it at your monitor number eight. Nine number the main where this is a code area. The number nine is a code area where you can actual the write the code here. Okay, it is an area where you can compose the code of a sketch and tells what what to do. Means this is the most important thing where you can write that sketch. Number ten, it is a message area. This area tells you the status on the saving code, compiling errors. So whatever the errors are there, it will be show there. Number eleven is a text console. It shows the details of an error message. So once if you have a verify button that is a pin number two that is a right mark scene when you have to upload the sketch and when you have to just verify the button if there is a any error occur in that program it will show in your element number areas where that is called as a text console where it will show the details of the errors size of the program that can be compiled so accordingly if there is a error just you have to modify it. And the last number that is a twelve number at the uh, right side, bottom right side. It tells you what the board is being used. Means it will show the serial port number. It will show you the serial port number which has to be used in the whenever you have to code the right. This is all about the general ID of this Arduino unit. Thank you.